guys is ready so for this earrings you're gonna be needing a couple of like smallish bows now the ones that i'm using here this is pretty random they came in a set that my nieces gave me like two or four years ago. i didn't remember it's pretty old to decorate some like christmas socks they came like the socks in this kit but it comes with bows and i thought i would just use them for this because they are like the perfect size they also came with this other bows which i love this shape of them but for this diy the red bows make a lot more sense because of their shape so i just wanted to share with you where i got this like bows from there are a lot of like decorating kits that come with this kinds of like bows you can use those or you can just make your own from like ribbons and stuff but mine because well they came in the set it's all packed in there and all this kinds of like pre-made bows they tend to be like super flattened and they lose their shape or their like fluffiness you can try to do this with your finger to just flatten the whole thing but it won't do much you need something else and for that i'm gonna be using my tweezers my hair strainer and i'm pretty much just ironing the corner like that like opening up that part and then once it's done i'm gonna be placing some straws in there just so that the heat from like the strainer let them cool down in the shape I'm going to be painting them because I want them black with my black acrylic paint and my tiny brush. Again, feel free to use black ribbon or just search for pre-made black bows if you prefer. Once my paint is dried, I'm going to be removing my straw and painting them from the inside. Then I'm going to be taking a couple of copper jump rings, my super glue, and I'm going to be gluing those jump rings on the edges like that. One on top and one at the bottom, helping myself with my pliers to just glue those in place. Feel free to use like a double eye pin, glue the bow in the middle this method that i did here was easier for me and this is how i'm letting them dry by the way when i'm like gluing them i'm going to be working on the huge pearls well they are not huge they are like big for that i'm going to be using my personal clay it dries with air but feel free to use plumber clay if you prefer it's pretty much the same result then i'm going to be using my cookie cutter that came in this set these are the sizes of that if you can see anything there yeah i'm just going to be rolling some clay with my roller that has those two green rings on each side those are there just so that i can have the same thickness throughout my clay therefore all my shapes are like the same size cutting two circles washing this drum I'm done and then just rolling those into spheres like this between the palms of my hands then i'm going to be using a couple of pins and then just letting them dry after this if you're using polymer clay this is when you make it painting them using my pearl white acrylic paint and my brush then i'm going to let them dry in a block of foam like a piece of block of foam adding some gloss using the one by sculpey adding two or three coats letting them dry between coats then i'm going to be taking these eye pins i made another like loop on the other side of the eye pin i have a diy showing you how to do that cutting this eye pin remove my pin glue my eye pin in there then i'm simply going to take my pliers and i'm using this beautiful copper ear wires by the way reopening my eye pin placing my bow there closing my eye pin then repeat on the other side like opening my ear wires placing my bow then just closing it and yeah guys these are the earrings that i want to share with you i love them i love how dainty but statement they are i think they look super nice fancy in a way fun and like festive and ready to party pretty much something like classic but with an edge i feel like they are heavy because of the pearl but they are not like crazy heavy they are pretty affordable to make and i think they look really nice and yeah hopefully you like them too if you did don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and let me know down below check out more christmas earrings that i have on my channel subscribe for more and share this thank you so much for watching i'll talk to you later and take care bye